seven yard gainer on first down. Good start for the offense, too. Here's another dive play. Ponches Mason, Jordan Mason, the young redshirt freshman from Gallatin, Tennessee. Talked about the depth or lack thereof at a place like Alcorn. Well, they can't practice cutting really as much. Straight ahead, Mason breaks free. Touchdown. Starts up front, West. Just look at it. Like it before anybody can even get a hand, a whiff. You know what? Paul Johnson likes it too, which surprised me yesterday. I was scared to ask him about the new unis, but he likes them. There goes Jordan Mason off to a great start. But remember, Cravante Benson and Charlie Thomas are two of three guys who we're going to see today. Mm -hmm. Division one double A, and of course, great career with the Titans, three-time Pro Bowler. Big lick here on first down against the running back Mason. The leader getting them done, getting it done and moving the chains for him. Dive again. Here's Mason straight ahead. Alvin Wilson to stop, one of the linebackers. Five-yard run. It is of note. All 25 yards or more runs. Big runs on the ground. And here is Jordan Mason on first and goal. Banging away. You just got to try to do it for four quarters because it's not a lot of depth. Look at Mason back in the ball game. He had the game's first score, and he got nine there. Lucas getting hurt. They just they had to, they had to put him there. You have to have three quarterbacks in this system. And, and Paul Johnson just is speed, just elusively fast. Brian didn't make the trip. Yep. A late scratch. So here is Mason again on first down, and now Jordan Mason picking up five, almost six on the first carry. And that, again, that first play, they had something going. Can they keep it going now? After you know, here's a four-yard game. That's that's fine. That's, that's that's what you want on first down. That's a win. Mason, first down to the 40. To move the chains. That's Cersei in motion. Marshall pitches, and this is Mason around the edge. Jordan Mason inside the 20, 15. And inside the 10, first and goal, Georgia Tech at the 7. Before Wargenis, the linebacker, saved the touchdown on a 33-yard run. Marshall out of the base set in the spread option. Quick pitch. This is Mason. Through two tackles. Jordan Mason to the 31-yard line. Second in the full 10. Middle screen for Mason, and... Get a couple of yards to the 41 on the catch. Second and seven. That's on the toss. Got an alley there and a first down run by Mason. And Mason into Clemson territory near the 40 yard line. From defenses, but not, not so extreme as you did these last couple plays. Here's Mason bouncing inside. First and goal, Georgia Tech on the run by Jordan Mason. Brandon Harris, the leading tackler for the Falcons on the stop. Up a, a hole. It, a little bit bigger than you're used to around here. Cersei in motion. They'll hand it to Mason. Touchdown. Second rushing score of the year for Jordan Mason. Take it. That's the fourth completion of the day on five attempts. Here's Jordan Mason rattling up the middle for about six or seven on first down. Watch stance and the ability to come back and drop him. Right ahead, Mason. He will go untouched. 33 yards for the touchdown. Good touchdown run of the day for Mason. You know, again, it's interesting. You've got a, a Georgia Tech offensive line. I had a talk with Sean Bedford, who was a great center here. Cottrell went in motion. He'll hand it to the B-back, Jordan Mason. He'll plunge ahead. Another good run on first down. Yellow Jackets, this is what they do. They are good at possessing the football. Touchdown. Jordan Mason, his fourth rushing touchdown of the year, and it is all Georgia Tech here in Louisville tonight. On the ground, this triple option has been hard to handle for this Louisville defense. Let's just watch the left guard, Parker Braun, fire off the ball. And you talk about creating space. Two to the near side. Mason is the lone setback, and they give it to Mason. 
And he'll plunge ahead for a few, and we get a timeout call by Georgia Tech. Second down at four. This time it's Jordan Mason. He's going to be very close to a first down. Looks like he got him. Yep, they'll move the chains. Quan Marshall's gotten downhill a lot of times. That's forced his hand with some decision makings. It allows him to protect it just a little bit more. Here's Mason. Wow. To the 39-yard line. His eighth carry here tonight, and they've all been pretty good. And it's the second time we're seeing this kind of play. It's that B-back dive, but they pull, again, the left guard, Parker Braun, with a quick trap. And so we're seeing all the options within this option. He is tipping the scales right around 400 pounds. A true freshman. Jordan Mason rips up another good run for the Yellow Jackets as we go down to cart. Marshall will hand off. It's Jordan Mason, and he'll rumble and tumble inside the five. So he comes in to Quan Marshall, nicked up a little bit earlier tonight. Jordan Mason on this run inside the 10. So first down, goal to go for Georgia Tech. Tobias Oliver, redshirt freshman. Game as we play in the first quarter. Third and short for the Jackets. Trailing Duke 7-0. Contact at the 35. The spot, though, is out near the 36 and might be enough as Jordan Mason had the carry for Georgia Tech. Forces the true freshman, Quez Jackson, to play that linebacker spot. So he's going to have to be up to speed right away. Second and nine, Jordan Mason. Opening moments of the second quarter. Marshall pitches it. Mason. Down to the 21-yard line for Jordan Mason, the redshirt freshman. Eight yards on the play. Second and ten for Georgia Tech. They're going up the middle with Jordan Mason, redshirt freshman. Georgia Tech has dominated the time of possession. A part of that is the Hokies' offense has scored so fast. The B-back gets it and straight ahead running for a nice gain and maybe... Just a little trip short of a touchdown, Jordan Mason. I mean, look at this surge. With all the blockers going down, cut blocking. As you wouldn't put your most sure-handed guy back there in Damon Hazleton. Jordan Mason is the B-back. He gets the ball. Touchdown. What a turnover and what a turnaround for the Yellow Jackets. That one hurts the Hokies. Fullback dive, especially in this part of the field, has been very good for Georgia Tech here in the first 24 minutes. And in this part of the field especially, Virginia Tech has had nothing to slow down the offense. That'll be another Georgia Tech first down. Jordan Mason with the carry. Oliver under center. Oliver gives straight ahead. Huge push immediately. And down to the five, it'll be first and goal. And he hasn't shown yet the ability to accurately throw the football. I mean, most of these formations, they're not, the wide receivers aren't even wide receivers. They're just basically lined up with the offensive line. Mostly still the same defensive looks for Virginia Tech here. They give it to that fullback. And inside the 15, Jordan Mason again. Turnover, big play, something Virginia Tech needs. And meanwhile, Georgia Tech showing no signs of any mistakes. Doing stuff like that. Touchdown! Jordan Mason just blowing his way through Hokies defenders right into the end zone. And this is turning into a route. I mean, Mason evading tacklers, running physical. The quarterback change is certainly part of it. They will give the ball straight ahead. Hey, this guy's been so tough. Jordan Mason gets wrestled down, got nine. Be changing colors at this point, right? It's going to happen fast. Second and one. Straight ahead for a first down. It'll be first and goal. Another one for Jordan Mason. Play clock is winding down. They get the ball snapped and a walk in. Touchdown, Georgia Tech. So out to the 28 yard line. The be back Mason out to the 32 is always end up in a positive third down Cersei in motion it's up the middle and it's a first down for the Yellow Jackets Jordan Mason moves the chains Oliver pitches it outside to Mason beat 
Artis around the edge, but out of bounds. Will create third down for Georgia Tech. Now Miami gives Georgia Tech a short field. Daquan Marshall going back to work with his triple option offense. And it's Jordan Mason on the pitch. And out of that timeout, third down and five. Mason spinning, working hard. He's got the first down and more. Down to the 24-yard line. 